There goes Julie. Groveton's trying to create their first opportunity of the game. Julie Glover gets a shot on net, and it goes, goes in. in. Groveton's first uh, shot. Oh, McCaig steps. There goes Glover. Ooh. And score. Glover with her second goal of the afternoon. Trip was there to pick it up, but that was dangerous. Got to be careful for that. Unofficially, the third shot of the game for Groveton. Good step up by the Groveton defender. There goes Parker. Colbrook ends up with it, trying to cross it. Shot on that by Rosito. It was Rosito, and then you had uh, Catherine Bushy there making the easy save. Oh, absolutely, and the, you know, the, they put the ball right across the front of the goal mouth. And gives you an opportunity here is Madison Parker on our side now. Um, Coach, what are, you, what are your thoughts on today's game? I think that it was a very aggressive game. We're dealing with some injuries, but we definitely moved the ball well, and I'm pretty happy with the outcome. Just want to get more wins under the belt because I think they only had two last year, and it was rough, and the girls are eager to win. They want to win now. I think we have a good group of girls, and just got to keep them competitive and want this win, and I think we can go far. So try to change fields. Let's look at that foot movement. Good heads up. Groped and possessed. A couple steps. Puts it in the corner. There's Groveton, takes the shot, and that's a score. Corbin Fernet. Corbin Fernet. Good fundamental soccer. Good give and go. A little bit of ping pong. Ooh, that ball's Did in off in? of Shane Holmes. Oh, man. Homecoming W today. What do you think about that? Well, it, it was big. You know, 0-3, and, and I had said before that it, it's, not, it's not what our season has been. 0-3, it looks bad, but it's very important. Like I said, one of us needed that first win. Um, very important win. Shane is, he may not be the biggest keeper. You know, we don't have that 6'2", 6'3", big monster that we used to have, but he's just straight out dives that most of us would not do. Um, but I'll touch, you know, Caden Colton and uh, uh, the Herbert boy, 150%, whatever they do. So even if you down on numbers, those boys are going to give you everything they got. And sometimes it can get a little rough, but they're passionate. Absolutely and I appreciate passionate. Them, them being out there. I really do. This was our fourth game, so it's our fourth loss, so we're 0-4. Um, but the potential is there. It's just a matter of time to make sure that, you know, the ingredients are there. We just got to make sure, hopefully next game, we can get that momentum going, finally have that win, and go up from there.